bản chuyên án các người có mặt tại đây là những tội phản của nhà nước truy tố các người là đã phản động nhân dân của nước cộng hòa việt nam đã công tác với trung quốc nước ngoài và âm mưu lật đổ chế độ hiện hành của chính phủ việt nam và dân tiền và giúp đỡ của kẻ thù dân tộc các người có mặt tại đây đã bị chú tốt nước hoàn quán quân sự và phải chịu hình phạt nặng nề chịu theo phạt luật xứng đáng với tội phản của các người đó là tội tự hình công khai Excuse me, sir. My name's Scott Wild. I'm looking for a friend of mine, an American. My friend teach me Taekwondo. Thai boxing, not the same. Hey, you're wasting your breath. He's not bilingual. What's your problem, lady? I wasn't asking you. I'm looking for my friend Mac. Hey, name and I? Kaupu kickboxing ja America. Dem we Thai, teeny jip joy ma. You speak the language pretty good. Now, what'd you say to him? What I said and what I implied are two different things. What's his problem? He just busted his training bag. Must be looking for something to stuff it with. Tell him to try his mother. Oh! 
Can anybody ever teach him the difference between hospitality and hospitalize? Yeah, you get what you can afford. Well, let's see what he can afford. How'd you choke cup crew? Okay. Now that you're warmed up, how would you like a real fight? I'd love to go a couple rounds with you. Once I found my friend, Mac Jarvis. Mac Jarvis? What do you want with that bag of foul wind? Don't call him names. Mac's been like my brother since I was a teenager. You know, he's a Vietnam hero. Big deal. So were thousands of others. What's the matter? He love you and leave you? He couldn't tie his own shoelaces. Never mind something so complicated. Please, just tell me where he is, and I'll be gone before you can say go. Yeah? You might try the superstar in Pat Pong. It used to be his pit stop. What's Pat Pong? It's the skid row for misfits. If I were you, I'd stay clear from that area, if you want to keep all your parts. Thanks for the pep talk, but I got to do it my way. Thanks, I'll take a rain check. Check. Okay. okay. Check. Mm -hmm. Check. 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 <sighs> this ain't my day. May I speak to Sue Lin, please? One moment, please. Come in, it's open. <laughs> this one like you big. Virgin two. Special price for you big dog. No, get what? out. Hey, Sue Lin. What's that? What a big honey. Uh, nothing, it's just my phone. Why, this phone? Yes, this is number one, you know. This is Lynn speaking. Miss Wing, this is Frank Dobbles, assistant registrar of Oberlin College calling. It appears we have some problem with your diploma. My diploma? It appears the graduation committee of the dean's office 
are greatly disappointed with your, shall we say, somewhat scandalous relationship with Mr. Scott Wilde, we must request that you return your diploma immediately. Scott, cut it out. Where are you? In Bangkok. I just got here. But you said you'd be here next week. I miss you, baby. I miss you, too. Have you told your parents yet? I was waiting for you to get here. Where can we meet to, uh, you know? Have dinner? I know a fantastic place. The Palace Garden on Sokovic Road. I got a better idea. Why don't hey, we have... Hey, you! This... You keep for you, this girl number one in Thailand. Forget Come it. I don't want that one. Scott! Scott! What's going on? Throw you get her out of my room! Sorry, honey. Uh, it's a bell captain trying to deliver someone's dog in this room. Try next door! Like I was saying, I'll see you there. Okay. I'll make reservations. Bye. Okay, bye. Good evening, sir. May I have you, sir? Table for two, please. Do you have reservations? I'm supposed to meet someone here. Can you page her? Su Lin Wing. Oh, this way, sir. Thank you. Must be doing pretty good. I suppose he's got shares in a diamond mine, too, huh? I thought you said Vietnamese people were poor. They are. My dad's electronics, that's all. I ordered some of my dad's favorite dishes. In case you might want to impress him. Well, what's good for your dad's good for me. What's all this stuff? This is deep fried locust. That is steamed cicada. And that one over there is smoked dried iguana. And these are steamed meatballs, right? No, they're tiger's balls. Real tiger's balls? I can see your dad could be a tough guy to negotiate with. I think I'll try the soup instead. Not even gonna ask. Maybe I like this one better. It's special. Oh, great. I love this stuff. I have it all the time when I go to Chinese restaurants. Mm, you know, this is the best bean curd I've ever had. Scott, dear, plus a monkey's brain. <laughs> Very funny, sweetheart. This way, it gets better. <laughs> of all the hotels in Bangkok, how did you find this one? Well, the guide map said it was a five star. Just pretend it's the Beverly Hills Hotel. I don't like it, Scott. It gives me the creeps.
Your Highness, as you can tell, I've spared no expense. Your kindness won't go unrewarded. Hello? Hello? This is Wing Yang Kim speaking. Hello? Are you still there? What happened? What do you mean they are dead? How about the general? Hello? Hello? Is there anybody there? Damn it! classmates. I think I lied to you a little bit. My family isn't poor. They got a lot of money. My dad travels in high circles. Well, I won't hold it against him. Just so long as he accepts me for what I am. Anyway, money can't buy happiness. That's probably that damn pimp again. What pimp? Hey, I told you that I... Come on, 
ข้าไม่ได้ครับ Hey Is this the right address อุกองครับเขาขอเข้าที่เกิดเหตุครับอุกองดูดิครับ Hey what the hell is going on Why did you get it It's my fiance's I'm trying to find her parents to tell them I think she's been kidnapped You are Dolly For what You can't do this to me. I'm an American. Hey, you gotta read me my rights. You have no rights. This is Thailand. I want to see a lawyer. I'm gonna sue your ass. I l o n this freaking country when Mr. Wing gets through with you. Okay. What's your relation with Solin? I told you we're just friends. I told you we're just friends. How many times do I have to tell you the same thing before you understand? I want to speak to the American consulate. You should have thought of that before you start killing people in Thailand. Your consulate could have advised you better. I swear it wasn't my fault. You're trying to tell me those men were just dying for a fix? Hey, man. Drugs are a deadly trip, you know. Shut up! What do you think? Well, General, do you think you can arrange it? Yes, if you have the green light from your American consulate. After I received your phone call, I informed the consul general. He's already given his consent. Captain, have the young man taken out to base five immediately. There'll be a plane waiting there to take him to Singapore. We're going to have to inform immigration to block his reentry visa for three months until this thing blows over. Give him some money. What happened was not his fault. He was only trying to help. You living on a special flight to Singapore. I suggest you do not return. Leaving? Why? What am I charged with? Murder. Or perhaps you like to hang instead.
doing? You know a guy named Mac Jarvis? Who? Big guy, about 200 pounds, 6'3", American. I'm space. Thanks. How's it going? Jesus, you still pissing on the wrong kid? What's the matter, big man? Can't put him down? Hurt kid. Let's go get a beer. <laughs> Hello, darling. Song beer sing. You know, I didn't need your help back there. I can take that guy with no problem. <laughs> sure, kid. Still the same cocky green belt, huh? That was ten years ago, Mac. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see you've improved since then. You bet your ass I've improved. What's the matter? Nothing. Grab your beer. I want to show you something. Okay. Come here. What's this murder business? How'd you know? Because you're the lead story in the local news, that's how. Now, what's going on? Two guys tried to kill me last night. That's what's going on. Because maybe you're packing a load of China White? Come on, Mac. You know me better than that. Yeah, I do. OK. You hungry? Start. I think I know a place where we can chow down without some bounty hunter trying to cash in your chips. Come on. the case you need it more than I do. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right, kid. <sighs> You've been over here too long. Look, kid, you gotta be practical. It's just Thailand. It's not Indiana. These things have a habit of working themselves out. Besides, I got a business to run. I got enough problems as it is. Mac, it doesn't sound like you. I thought you came over here for more high-powered action. Never thought you'd retire. Hey, cool it, farm boy. Don't drive the knife in any farther than... No, come. I know. So what's her third choice? Right, right. Come. Oh. 
Good chow and no bounty hunters, huh? It's the last time I have dinner with you. Well, cut the comedy. We're in a deep hole. We're gonna need a pat hand to get out of it. How about a royal flush? <laughs> statue. You don't move. Mac, that's one of the guys that took Sue Lin. Oh, yeah? Good evening. Where's the girl? Where's the girl? Get out of the way, kid. You don't want to get hit with the spray. Kind of like punching open a can of beer. Can you look that? It's Vietnamese for climb Death Mountain. What the hell's that? Cambodia. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> something here from Uncle Sam. A little import-export business, you might say. Pays the rent, huh? Mm. <laughs> what did you say Su Lin's dad's name was? It's Wing Young Kim. Why? Because we ain't talking kidnapping here, boy. We talking war. Wait a minute, wait a minute. War? What kind of war? Wing Young Kim is a very well-known Vietnamese refugee in this area. When the good guys folded up their uh, cards in Saigon, he split with his family and a whole shitload of personal wealth, which Ho and the boys conveniently called people's gold. Now, to make matters worse, the rumor is he's trying to personally fund some kind of a coup. I know for a fact he's in tight with the Khmer resistance fighters in Cambodia. They've been fighting the VC for years. They'll take a crack at him any chance they get. What's that got to do with Su Lin and me? Well, it seems there was a major purge in the Kong army the night before last. A whole lot of big boys got wasted. Su Lin was taken last night. And they killed everyone in her family. Wrong. Not everyone. Her father escaped. How do you know? <laughs> I thought you were a brain surgeon. Right. Anybody with brains enough to need surgery would have been out of here a long time ago. Very funny. So why don't we find Su Lin's dad? Because he's hiding somewhere, or he's dead. Well, either way, I don't have enough juice to find him. You see this? 
It's the Toker of 19F. It's a recently upgraded edition. I'm afraid your lady's become prime bait. Somebody heavy wants her old man, and bad. Is that the bottom line? What makes you so sure? Because this little baby wouldn't be in our Viet friend's hands tonight unless it was provided by a Soviet special advisory group. My guess is they're operating somewhere in Cambodia. We gotta get her back. Sure. All we do if we take that division of Marines I got parked out in the back, march them down the middle of the Vietnamese Army, and demand a release, right? You got any better ideas? Yeah, skip the wedding march. Find yourself another playmate. Asia's teaming with them. Mac, Su Lin's gonna be the mother to my kids. With you or without you, I'm gonna get her back any way I can. You want to start a war? You got one. It's a hell of a reunion, though, bud. Besides, what would people say if I let some cherry ass go bopping off in a bush by himself? Now you're talking. Yeah, well, talk buys time, but we got to cover space and fast. Now, we're going to need some special transportation. A load of goodies for the natives. You take MasterCard? Sorry. You'd need a flying circus to move old Sudden Doom. Besides, you can't afford it. We're gonna go like this? No, I'll get you some black pajamas and you'll fit right in. All right, look, let's get cracking. I got some phone calls to make. That should do it. Shop will be here any minute. Let's get it. You got it.
welcome aboard, boys. Terry, what are you doing here, you witch? Right now, she looks like an angel. If you were expecting Santa Claus, you're in for a big surprise. So what'll it be for you two Boy Scouts? Standard tour of Bangkok? Kill a son of a bitch and booked her. This broad doesn't know the difference between a rotor and a blender. Speak for yourself. Nobody knows this territory like I do. Besides, I'm the best. Infiltrating political backyards is my specialty. Anyway, what? had I known it would have been the two of you, I would have told the jobber to screw off. Fine. Set this bird down and let me fly it. Oh, no. I don't have no death wish. Well, neither do I. Would you two tell me what's going on? Ah, oh, she's pissed because I wouldn't jump her bones. He's threatened because I used to break his. Yeah. You know, there's a fine line between sex and violence. It's too bad you erased it. I didn't know you were so discriminating. <clears throat> Listen, if you two guys want to pull out, that's fine with me. I get paid either way. That sounds familiar. Terry, remember, you get what you can afford. Listen, Blue Eyes. Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. You, you two know each other? Yeah, we met at your old gym. Oh, jeez. Far bags are under your seat, gentlemen. You probably need them. ผู้กองได้ข่าวเกี่ยวกับลูกสาวเพราะมันเนี่ยก็ยังไม่ได้มีข่าวเขาอะไรเลยนะครับแล้วเพื่อนชายของฟลินก็ได้หลบหนีไ
Hello. <laughs> well, Mac, what brings you to my country? It's, uh, it's personal, Colonel. Personal. <laughs> well, Mac, you always try me a hot bargain. <laughs> Come on, eh? Have a seat and be talk for you. Okay? <laughs> Colonel, Wing Yang Kim's daughter being held captive somewhere in the Cardamom Mountains. He's asked us to try and locate her and bring her back if she's still alive. The mountain range is a big area to cover. Besides, it's in Vietnamese held territory. What made you think that I know where she is? Does the tiger sleep on unfamiliar ground? Why should I do this favor to you? Her father would be very grateful. It's true. Wing Yang Kim has been an asset to our cause. But we have a clue. Climb Death Mountain. Now this time, you're asking a lot, my friend. Clam Death Mountain is the code name for the tight security Soviet training based deep within the jungle of the Kadamon Range at the source of the Sangha River. The Soviets are marshalling hardcore Vietnamese and Cambodian insurgents to search and destroy dissident groups throughout the area. Their mode of operation involves both terrorism and torture of the worst kinds. The long-term objective is to subjugate the peoples of Southeast Asia. The most immediate objective is to annihilate our resistance movement. We have tried to get men in there, but none have come out. It must be worth a lot of money to you to come so far. Well, she's worth a lot to her father. I see. So it would cost you. Cost? No problem. You see this? I got a hundred of these. Special, just for you. 20% off. Sorry, Mac. I need more firepower than that to handle the Vietnamese artillery. Well, Colonel, sir. I got it. Will this do it? Wait a minute. Hold it. I, uh... <laughs> I see. You're holding on me, Mag. No. Come on, never mind. I take one. Of course. And I pay you in black rice. I don't know, Colonel. Opium, I... Come on, Mac. For you, it's a piece of cake. Sure, Mac. You can always smoke the profits. Come on. Oh, what the hell. Colonel, you did it again. You win. Good. <laughs> now that's just one other condition I would like to mention. One other condition. I keep the pilot till you return. No way! You can eat shit and die, Colonel. <laughs> oh, you mean like a security deposit. That's right. Well, Colonel, what makes you happy having her around here? I'm happy. You guys got to be kidding. I'm not going to stand for this bullshit. You guys are all sucking up flies. I'm getting the hell out of here. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> I'll kill you, Mac. I swear to God, I'll do it. Like I was saying, Colonel, you drive a hard bargain. Uh, don't wait up for us, honey. Right when you get work. <laughs>
Kid, you brought me a heap of trouble. So what do we do now? Get the hell out of here. What else? What about Sue Lin? I can't leave without her. We're not exactly equipped to take on the entire Red Menace now, are we? Never mind. You and your friend have a good time. <laughs> I take it back, kid. On second thought, this screaming excuse for a broad will have the commies running for cover like stink on... Shut up, Mac, before I pound the wind out of you. You know, that was a dirty trick you tried to pull back there. Mac had a plan. What plan? It's enough there for burnt toast. If it weren't for the aerial acrobatics, the bastards would have never got a fix on us. Knock it off, Mac. It's no more her fault what happened back there than it is yours for being in love with her. Thanks a lot, Scott. You really have a vivid imagination. So let's figure out where we go from here. It's your campaign, kid. I vote we head back. You don't get a vote. You're just long for the cheap laughs. I love you too, Mac. Well, you two do as you like. I'm gonna find that camp. Her father must have offered you guys a bundle. Well, I'm with Scott. That is, if you want me. Hey, Florence Nightingale. I could use a little attention over here, too. I thought all snakes shed their skin. Didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is missing, but we have his daughter. Bring her to me. Yes, sir. Come, Nate! The devil is Khmer Rouge. The one about to die is his Chinese contact. He fights like a tiger. Cut him loose. You are a good fighter. No? Good. I give you a chance to fight for your life against me.
You know, too bad, my friend. For this, you may walk out of fear of free men. Don't be afraid, my dear. I will not hurt you. Now we wait for your father. He will come for you. No? You disgusting. The animals are calling for you. Do you hear them? Don't give up hope, Miss Wing. After all, that's what's keeping you alive. You hear that? Yeah, you could bet it ain't no dinner bell. It's a bunch of Buddhist monks. They should be able to give us directions. Uh-huh. Directions? I don't trust nobody don't eat meat. Come on, Mac. All they do is sing and shake beads all day. Touch is in ought to do the trick. I got your touch. Mac, Scott's right. They're harmless. Besides, a bowl of veggies could do you some good. I hear they're great for constipation. Like a summer camp for monks. We're gonna have a barbecue tonight. Sure, Mac. How about some barbecued rice? <laughs> My favorite kind. <laughs> uh... What? Give me your weapon. Why? They're not allowed on Buddhist premises. Are you crazy? This is Cambodia. Mac, just do what he says. You already have enough bad karma. You don't need more. I know. That's what I'm worried about. I don't like this, kid. Thank you. 
you get it in Buddha? Well, the I... The frog's ass watertight? Mac. Can you tell us where the main branch of the Sankar River is from here? Are you lost? We're looking for a friend. I see. What do you see? Let's go at the sunset. I will show you the way. Come. second class. I will send you by helicopter. You must have been a poacher in your past life. It's catching up to you, pal. What? You just made the endangered species list. <laughs> <laughs> I knew she'd run. Never trust a fraud. Just turning the boat around.
guess there's something to be said about all this religion after all. Matt, check this out. Looks like we found the real monks. Yeah, looks like some forced meditation. Hi, guys. Behind door number two, we happen to have a new breed of rusty pineapple. Designed to take out about half the city block. Yeah, well, what's all this stuff for? I'd say these little bundles of joy are heading up river to Little Russia. Yeah, let's make a delivery. Get it straight. I don't deal with flunkies. You're gonna have to fight me yourself. I expected an American to have better manners. <laughs> Pity. Your foolish friends are dead. Soon you will follow them if you're not careful.
Back roads from here on in. Besides, water doesn't leave a trail. You think you can make it up there? I don't know. Back roads are a bitch. เออขณะนี้ก็กำลังมีการลบของทหารเวียดนามอยู่ในกัมพูชาการที่ลูกสาวท่านหายไปนี่ผมเชื่อว่าคงต้องมีแผนอะไรสักอย่างนะฮะก็คิดว่าเธอคงไม่อยู่ในเมืองไทยตอนนี้แต่ถ้าท่านจะนําทองไปที่ผมแดนเนี่ยผมเชื่อว่ามันอันตรายมากผมก็คิดว่ามันเป็นคนรวงมากันแหละแต่ผมเชื่อว่ามันต้องการทองมากกว่าต้องการตัวผมนะแต่ผมไม่มีที่ที่อื่นที่จะเลือกแล้วก็ลูกสาวก็เป็นสมบัติสุดท้ายที่ผมเหลืออยู่ผมต้องเสี่ยงเอาละก็ขอบคุณนะสวัสดีขอบคุณที่ช่วยเหลือผมนะมาอะไรAm I going too fast for you? Have you heard the theory about small brains and big dicks? Enough! You make a spot of me. It's not hard. You attacked my soldiers. Monks! They were monks, and they attacked us first. You were on your way here. Ah, uh, I just hate it when a group goes all out for tourists and then treats them like shit. You know, I, the same thing happened to me in Bermuda. Shut up! This 
is what you risk your life for doesn't seem quite worth it, does it? Don't worry about ending up like her, my dear. You won't have time. Uh, Sulin, remember when I told you we were waiting for your father? We've just learned that he's gone back to America, leaving you behind. Uh, no! Your father was the only thing keeping you alive, Sulin. Since he doesn't seem to care for you, we certainly can't. My only choice is to kill you. You bastard! I hope you understand that it was his choice, not mine. The blood is on your father's hands. They're building your execution platform now. Oh, yeah? I'll see that you use it first, mister. That's a promise. <laughs> One you never keep. By the way, if I hear from your tour company, I try to get you a refund. Jesus, kid, you want a Chinese gong to beat on, too? Here. Beat on that for a while. I think our best move, kid, is to get the hell out of here. You're forgetting Su Lin. Yeah, I suppose I am. I got one question to ask you. What's that? You think you could hit my head, that crossbow from over there? Yeah, I suppose so. Why? Is that an invitation? No, it's not. I got an idea. First, we gotta take out that guard tower. So How come you're here? I wish I knew. We came here to take you back to your father. But I'm really here because of Scott. Scott Wilde? You know him well? We're supposed to get married. Where's Scott now? Is he okay? Uh, he's on his way with Mac. They should be here by morning. Don't worry. It'll be okay.
Remove the blindfolds. <laughs> I wanted you to be a part of this morning's feeding. I think you'll find this most entertaining. You know, you really missed your vocation. You would have been a big hit at the circus. You're a cross between a jackass and a snake. Enough. We begin. <laughs> You gotta nail that target on the other side, otherwise. Don't worry. You're covered, man. Catch you later. You know what to do. Get some. Let's do it. I designed it so that our friends will dine on your feet first, then on your legs. Quite clever, no? Is that you I smell? Or crocodile shit?
Use your leg. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. I guess you owe me one. So what else is new? We're Scott! Just don't, don't even move. Just. Oh, Jesus. You never could stand still, could you? You never asked me. Doesn't mean I didn't want to. Doesn't mean I would have anyway. You always had to get in the last word, didn't you?
She's gone, Scott. Let's get the hell out of here, all right? <laughs> 